Hello and welcome to my video, Artistly AI Image Generator. And specifically in this video, I'm going to look at the mirror magic feature that allows us to generate images that mimic other images. Let's jump over to my browser and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Here I am in my browser and what I'm going to show you is how to use Artistly to mimic an image and I'm into book covers. So I'm going to go and mimic a book cover. Let's say we want to create a book cover. So I'll come here to Amazon and I'll go to the Kindle store where I'll look up one of my book covers, Moving Violation. Now let's say we really like this book cover and we'd like to create another book cover like it. Well, all I've got to do is right click on the image and say, save image as, It'll give me a name and I'll put it in my downloads directory. There, we've saved a copy of the image. Now what I'm going to do is replace Amazon with Artistly. Artistly is a web-based tool. It stores everything in the cloud and you export images to your computer. I'm going to go to app.artistly, that's artist with an L-Y on the end, dot AI. Now, if you want to just see Artistly, go to artistly.ai. This is the interface for using it once you purchase a license. And here I'm going to create design. I'm going to use the advanced AI image designer. And here I want to create an image. Now, I'm going to call this sample book cover. And I like to make my images five inches wide or my book covers five inches wide, which is 1,500 pixels. This is 300 pixels per inch and eight inches tall, which is 2,400 pixels. There, that gives me a book cover sized image. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over to my media and I'm going to upload that book cover that we saved from Amazon. Here I've got a copy of it in my edit session. Now what I do is I come to AI Designer. This is where you would usually create a prompt to design a book cover. And I'm going to say Mirror Magic instead of Image Generator. And all I've got to do is select an image in my panel here and say Generate Prompt. Now I don't have to write a prompt to generate this book cover. It's going to write a prompt for me. Now I can edit this prompt by coming to edit prompt with AI and take a look at it in a better session. And here you can see that it's got moving violation in it, uh, the title moving violation, make moving and violation. Now let's say I wanted to change the title of the book from moving violation to something else. I can use a prompt to modify this prompt. So let's say we want to change the title used in this book cover from moving, moving violation to something up, something's up, change the author name from Melanie Jackson to Brian Jackson. Now everywhere where it used these words, it should modify them and create a new prompt for me. Now it's rewritten the prompt. I can come back into the edit prompt with AI and see that it now has something's up instead of moving violation and it has Brian Jackson as the author. Let's go and generate its interpretation of this image. Now remember what this image looks like. Let's go to generate an appropriate sized image. And here's its interpretation of this book cover. Now it used something much more comic and it put in some garbage text that I would have to remove in an external editor, but it changed this book cover. Check that out. The original, its interpretation with something's up. So I can take images and I can mimic them 
Once again, let me show you this. I'm going to save this, create a new project. Square is fine. And what we want to do is come to AI Designer and use Mirror Magic. Now that will require us to select an image from our canvas to mimic. And I can just grab anything pretty much out of my media library. And that's how to use Mirror Magic in Artistly 4.0 AI to mimic other images, in this case, a book cover.